Good afternoon, everyone. First of all, let me congratulate you all for your efforts in getting good CET score. I'm Dr. Jagruti Save, and I'm heading the AI and DS department at FRCRC. Artificial intelligence and data science being the talk of the hour, there cannot be a better time to get started with these technologies. COVID pandemic outbreak has further increased the demand for AI engineers and data scientists. Thus, learning these skills in the current situation can present high employment chances. Various institutes across the country and abroad offer graduate, postgraduate degree in this domain. Till now, the field of AI and DS has been a preferred choice for postgraduate program. But the increasing demand for the skilled professionals is making it imperative for students to start early. And that's where an undergraduate course in this area can help. We at FRCRC are delighted to inform you all that our college would also be introducing a new branch, Bachelor of Engineering B in AI and DS from this year onwards. In this era of fourth industrial revolution, almost all the industries are stepping into automation, where I feel AI and DS play a very important role. So in light of the same, we felt it is a need of the hour to introduce a new branch dedicated to these emerging technologies. I would like to take this opportunity to share with you a brief overview of what this branch would enter. I won't take much of your time. Just I want to share a little bit, three to four slides with you so that you can get a glimpse of AI and these. I'm sharing my screen with you, simple definitions. So artificial intelligence is the science and engineering of making computer machines able to perform the tasks which normally require human intelligence, such as visual perception, speech recognition, decision making, translation between languages, and so on. So it's a branch of computer science that aims to develop intelligent computer machines. Whereas data science is a multidisciplinary field that uses mathematics, statistics, computer science to mine the knowledge from data. It basically deals with the vast volume of data using modern tools and techniques and try to find the unseen patterns, derive meaningful information and make the business decisions. My next slide talks about the industry trends from different websites, publication. I could find some key highlights relevant to the AI and DS and I, I have projected here. If you go through it, you will get a glimpse of impact of this field on the job market in the coming years. Like recent NASCOM report says, we have shortage of qualified and skilled people in AI area. Whereas Harvard Business Review says most of the companies are investing in AI. I feel AI DS are among the hottest field of 21st century that will impact all the segments of daily life by 2025, from transport, logistics to healthcare and to customer service. My next slide talks about the career prospects. A career in this field looks more promising than any other jobs available these days due to the wide application of it in different fields. Here I've listed few job roles like data analyst, but definitely the career scope is wide and not limited to this. Future of AI DS seems bright because well-reputed companies like Apple, Amazon, Google, Facebook, IBM, Microsoft, and many other reputed companies, they are investing a lot in the research and development of AI. The, there is a broad set of techniques that come in the domain of AI and DA. Some of them are listed here. So if you're looking forward to learning, then you should know the subjects or the skills you will learn in your course. Of course, this list is small. As and when the new subjects, new skills are required, they'll be added to this list. My last slide talks about the infrastructure. At FRCRC, I want to assure you that my department has the experienced pool of faculty and ideal computing lab facilities to train the students in AI and DS domain. In short, AI and DS is the future of technology, which are changing the world at very high pace. Thank you so much for your attention.